So for those who don't know me, my name is James, and I'm a real estate agent here in Las Vegas. And we, we, I mean, my family and I, say hi, Ryder. Hi, Ryder. <laughs> we go around to Costco, find some good steals, some good buys, and point out some secrets others may not have known. We go try out some really good restaurants in Vegas, and essentially show you guys what it's like to live in Vegas as a family. And um, if you like what you see, and or you're just moving out to Vegas and you want an experienced real estate agent on an awesome team, because when you have a real estate agent, their team is their family. So say you hire a real estate agent and you're unsure, you've never met him, you hired him just now, or you found him on Zillow, however the case may go. The best way to judge your real estate agent is take a look at your team because that's who's going to essentially be in on your deal 100 percent not in on it but if your real estate agent needs help say hey i need to know this happened this happened what should i do here their broker and their team is going to say oh i had the same problem back in 2019 with the smiths and we ended up making all the mistakes but we figured it all out this is what you need to do that's what having a good team is all about and in order for me to know that i have to have a good team so super nice super friendly and honestly some there's some people that are just good people you know they want to help they go on to different platforms and teach and take time out of their day and give advice and and point people in the right direction just because they're not getting paid for it they're not getting attention from it. And this is what my team leader does. This is what my group does. They uh, they love expanding. So if people want to join, that's great. Very rarely happens because of the places that we're out and about in is not essentially recruiting type places, but that's how it works, you know? You're nice to people. People want to be a part of you. And if more people were like that, things would be better. Now, anyway, we're in Costco. We're getting some chicken and toys and decor. No, I'm telling you, the bread is somewhere here. Ow, killing myself here. Don't you hate, as you can see, I'm all sweat. Don't you hate when you're pushing the cart and you get yourself ran over in your ankles or whatever the case is. Someone's pushing the cart and runs over your ankles. It's horrible. 